I feel like a little kid drinking chocolate milk. Yum, 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 yum. Need my sugar. Ah! No, it's chocolate almond milk, but still really tasty. All right, I have some serious business to talk about. Today was a rough day in yoga teacher training. I'm part of a, a two-week intensive, which is actually three weeks, but then we had a week off. We're in the second week, coming up to the final stretch. It's the Wednesday. We end Sunday. And today was just, for some reason, a really rough day. It's been even a rough week. We have we have 13 people in our training, and a couple, if not more, have um, gotten sick, uh, missed a couple days, I missed a day or two, including myself. I wasn't sick, but I wasn't feeling really well. I wasn't sure if I was getting sick or I don't know. But today, I'm hoping today was the the peak and it will, or the valley, and then I'll go up from here because everybody was just like a zombie. We played what was called zombie games where we had to go and correct people, but seriously, everyone was a zombie. We just had no energy. Uh, I don't, I can't speak for everybody. It just, it, but it just seemed like this today. I know that in the morning we moved a lot. So we did a lot of uh, sequencing, yoga poses, moving the body, basically from seven to 11, we were moving around or at least eight, eight thirty to 11 or a couple hours. And I even did the 6 a.m. yoga class, so I was especially tired. And then around when we had our lunch break and um, everyone came back from lunch, we had the lights off, everyone was going to sleep, taking naps until the afternoon session, which we also got up and moved around a little more. And towards the end, towards 4 o'clock, everybody was dragging. They are just like, ugh. I don't know what it was. Either Was there something in the air? Was there something? Something just had us just like really just not in it today, but hoping once again that this is the bottom and we can go up from here because we still have a lot of training to get through. We have been learning a bunch of stuff, so much stuff that it's almost, it's mentally, it's not only, you know, mentally draining, physically draining, but mentally, you know, both mentally and physically together. I'm probably eating like way more than I would ever usually eat just because I have so, I'm expending so much energy. And I would have done the yoga or cross training class this evening, except um, I know that my body can't handle that. And if I did that tonight, I'd need to take another day off tomorrow or even two days because it's really intense. So I'm trying to pace myself. Like everyone says, two-weekers, us two-weekers, we need to start pacing ourselves. Just take it one step at a time. If you aren't feeling well or if for some reason you're just, you know, like I was today, my hamstrings and my legs just feel like jello. I'm just gonna like roll over in a mush. So that's my body telling me, hey Ashley, go eat some food and rest. And then come back tomorrow refreshed, you got this. So that's what I'm gonna do. So instead of taking yoga class this afternoon, I'll just come back, go to bed early, rest up, and take the yoga class in the morning. And that should be really great. So hoping for a great day. We have some awesome plans. I know that Friday we were told we were gonna do stand up paddle boarding. I really hope that happens. So it's going to be awesome. Um, yoga and paddle boards. Have you heard of it? Stand up paddle board yoga. Anyone? Or I could just stand up and try to balance. Whatever. But of course I'm going to try to do, be doing some yoga poses. So look forward to pictures of that if it happens. If and when, please. And then um, we have, uh, I have a surprise guest coming Saturday. Yo, do you guys know who that is? Oh, someone's flying in to see me Saturday and I'm so excited. And then um, I have a bunch of friends and people just, oh, I just have a really fun four to five days left of this training. So from here, from this low point, this really hump weekday, actually it was a valley day because Wednesday, I'm going to call it valley day. Usually it's hump day. It was valley day. So uh, from here, it's just going to go up, just going to get better we can all breathe and relax. So that's how I've been today. Just wanted to share.